Alright guys, we're back with the next episode of Borderlands the Pre-Sequel. Where we left off last time, I just kind of uh, took the liberty of making the short trek to Concordia cut down on a bit of recording time here. So basically... Alright, before our Merif rudely interrupted me, as I was saying... Ooh, I'll take it. Before our Merif interrupted me, as I was saying, uh, we're actually... What you guys missed, Jack is just coming down from Hyperion now. Guns! I got them, you need them. I'm just gonna sell some of my shiznit here. Oh god. So, Jack's coming down from Hyperion to meet us, we're gonna go confront the Merif. Oh, screw this. Let's go pay him a visit. Like I said, don't get trigger happy. If he's got info, I don't want to hear him gurgle it through blood. He has horrible diction to start with. <laughs> Excellent plan. Though don't forget that the Marif has somehow switched off the elevator. That's just great. I do have a recording of the Marif talking sexy to Serena, the custom bot's favorite squeeze. Nah, that wouldn't work. Perhaps we could blackmail the Marif with that smutty recording we have of him with the geisha bot. Yahtzee! Let's go find ourselves one soon-to-be-outraged Customs Claptrap. Get that recording ready, Mox. Okay, the Customs Trap... Should be in the bar, I think. Come back here! Oh. I am the law! The law doesn't make mistakes! Yeah, he does. We're here to file a complaint. Your awesome Marif's been breaking the law. We have evidence. Breaking the law? Why don't you tell me all about it? Thank you for your concern, citizen. Rest assured it shall be long. Long live the Marif. Mox, hit it. Oh, blimey. You really know how to listen to a bloke's problems. I'll give you that. You sure I can't book you for more, uh, uh physical services? Patrick Wawa. I'm a bloody stress volcano <laughs> right now, and I can do it the, uh, with the, uh, Damn! You know that's not what Geisha bots are programmed for. Oh boy. Serena, really? I'm your mirror. You'd be doing Concordia Republic service. Would make it worthwhile. I'm swimming in dial money right now. <laughs> the mirror's interfacing with my Serena. No! I feel so betrayed. And according to my records, the mirror doesn't have the appropriate paperwork to engage in such. Activities, which kind of makes my outrage morally justifiable. Awesome. Hey, I'm with you, pal. Word is, he's got another appointment booked with Serena right now. What? Citizens, that was not. That may have sounded like my voice, but yeah, Jack, you. Uh, Jack has the weirdest freaking run. This is just such a weird part in the. This is just so freaking weird. This guy's weird. corrupting my veracity regulators. This guy's so busted. Without an interorganic fraternization license, I'm gonna make his life a living hell. Come on, Dude, your voice is making go. my life a living Serena, hell. I'm coming, my love. This is more like it. And here we go. To the mirror. Seriously, you idiot machine. The offices are off. Right! I'm such a kidder. Off we go! Oh god. I hate claptrap units. Hate them. I want nothing to do with them. And the fact I'm playing as one. Let's let's just get this over with. I'm the sooner I can just kill this guy, the better. Gift shop? He has a gift shop? Just 
Just screw it. Oh god. No! Strike grenade! That was exciting. That was easy. Again, weird. Officer, get that door open! I don't take orders from civilians. However, as I was already going to do that... We can talk this out, Jackie. I don't really work for Zalman. Hunter Team Meredith, you are hereby under arrest for violating Elfin's Ethical Code 3110, forbidding unlicensed interplay between... Oh my God! You stole my girlfriend, you need that? Open! Yeah. Let's move it. I've always wanted to do this. Suck it. Jack Jackie! Ha <laughs> I you should have said you were a dead time. I sounded better in his head. Still makes me chuckle. The signal that took down our systems on Helios. And guess what? It came from here. Your office. Signal? Signal. She might be doing it. Where did she come from? And please, Ooh. lie to me. I really want you to lie to me. I don't know. What are you going to do with me? <laughs> Nothing. I was just messing with you. Get the hell out of here. I've been thinking there's a way back to Helios. I surrender. I was gonna let you live, dumb bastard. What is wrong with you? A lot, apparently. Oh, that was invigorating. Okay. Don't worry, I took yeah. care of the Harper. Where was I? All right, my awesome master plan. Taking the fight to Helios is gonna need an army, so we make one. Head down to Springs. I'll explain on the way. I'm gonna stay here. Gonna go through the Marif stuff. That's We're a point. We're making a freaking robot army, baby. Hell yeah! Shopping list simple. Some serious combat chassis and top of the line military AI to run them. Word is Springs is a lady for the AI. Hey, Mox, you know where I can build me some kick-ass robot bodies? Since that giant laser is gonna kill, well, everyone. Well, that was exciting. Another fantastic visit to your local public service representative. Josh, your local public service representative. Oh, damn. They're just firing their lasers. All right, so For I gotta get some reason yet to become clear that laser persists in firing at the surface of Elpis. How thrilling! Ah, there we go. Dragons. Okay, good for you. Good for you. Hey, it's Moxie said you're out for some military AI. Big saws. But your best bet's a mate of mine, a little ankle biter by the name of Pickle, lives in the Outlands. Oh, He's no. almost impossible to reach, mind, but I can help with that. Take this scrambler. What the heck? Intelligence of the artificial persuasion. It scrambles things. Now, okay. I'll upload coordinates of an old Dal garage to your Echo. Get going, I'll explain on the way. Okay, this better be good. Get a Stingray. Oh, yes. The Stingray. Oh, great. Where the heck am I going now? It ain't easy to get to Pickle's place on foot, but I can help you out with... Ready for it? A stingray. It's old Dal tech. They're not much to look at, but Moxie tinkered with the design, so now they jump like a skag in heat. Problem is, stingrays aren't easy to get to meat hunts on. So happens that Scrambler, uh, 
came my way. It's supposed to unlock digestructing at the old Dahl garage I'm sending you to. Once you unlock a stingray there, I'll fix it so all moon zoomies are stingrayed up. What the heck is this place? It's over here. Yeah, be like right here. Nope, not where. Gotta go. I have to go in the back? Oh, man. Oh, God. blew him away. Hey, here we are. What about that door? Combo's 8008. Don't ask me how I know. At least the place still has power. 8008. Aggressively. Gosh darn it. No! Yay. Before Dahl upskirts and left Elpis, they integrated Moxie's improvements into the production model. They deny it, though. Plug in the scrambler to that Digistruct machine. Okay. That's it. Now just order yourself up a Stingray. Hooray! Black Cannon. I like the... Yeah, Black Cannon's fine. Oh, that's cool. Stingray is a hover bike. Okay, I don't care. Hack their system to copy a fresh plan over, so you'll be able to digestruct these anywhere from now on. Now get your backside to see Pickle. Though feel free to get a feel for her first. See what she can do. What the heck is this? Where am I even going here? I have like no icon on the map. Yay! Nice! I've told Pickle you're coming. Just go meet him. I think this is... Yeah, this is where I have to go. Oh, that's kind of odd. There's nothing... There's nothing to indicate. This is Colonel Zarpadon of the Lost Legion. Soon Elpis will be rubble. I will be dead from the explosion along with everyone on Elpis and most of those living on Pandora below. I've seen you fight, and I respect your skill. If you agree to leave now... I will send you an interstellar ship. We will not follow you. Think it over. Pretty good deal. Why didn't you take it? What do you think we were? A bunch of mustache twirling villains? Jack hired us to kill bad guys, get paid, and help people. No different from you. You say you're anything like us, and I'll kill you where you stand. Konnichiwa, everybody. Wanna play another round of bunkers and badasses? Not now, Tina. Oh, right. Scary time. I always get lost in here, like, I literally have no clue where- oh, this way. Hey, look at that. I, yeah, looks like up here I have to go? I always get so easily lost in this freaking area. Oh yeah, I've gotta go through here. This should be pleasant. And there's lots of Okay, this is cool. Ah! Oh. That went surprisingly well. Okay, where is my next victim? Oh, he's way the hell up there. Yeah, he can live. I'll let him live. Whoosh. Switch. It's Jack, right? I'm Roland. Moxie dropped me a line. Said you need a hand building robots. My, uh, colleague 
Lilith and I spotted some old doll industrial complexes dotted around the area. A scout around might solve your hardware problem. We'll let you know. Sounds good. I come you when you got something. Yay! Friendship. Fingersmith Halls. Eh. This guy annoys me more than Claptrap. Things they got over there look bang tidy. And he's British. All right, guys, I'm going to cut it right there before we meet the phenomenally annoying Davis Pickle, another British man. So until next time, guys, see ya.